Hello guys, welcome to Tech Design. Hope everyone is doing great. And in this tutorial, we will discuss on view creation wizard. So as soon as you enter into a drafting workbench, you can see that uh, a window will pop up, which will show us to create and uh, you know views for uh, drawings. So which is nothing but a views uh, creation wizard. So what we will do is we'll just you know click uh, go into a drafting workbench. So we can just directly go into drafting here. So as soon as you would go to drafting, it will ask you the sheet. So let me keep, keep it as it is. And as you can see here, always start view creation. So view creation wizard or base view. So we will keep it as a view creation wizard. So this will, you know, uh, pop up in view creation wizard. So this is what we talk about today uh, about uh, view creation wizard. So this is simple that uh, it is a simple view creation, uh, you know, window where you need to select a multiple views, uh, which views you want and uh, uh, what are the, you know, um, the lines you want, whether you want to show hidden lines or uh, edges, you want to show that or you want to hide that. So all the customized things, you can just do it for all the views at a time. So we can just select a part here. As you can see, this is a part. So suppose if you have a multiple parts, you can just select them. If you have an assembly, you can also select an assembly here. And then we can go just go to options. So in the options, we can see here. Uh, view boundary and uh, process hidden lines whether you want to show the hidden lines say for example if you want to make a hidden lines with the dashed uh, lines so you can just select it uh, so this is all customized depending on your requirement as you can see here also if the views you want to wire make a wireframe so you can just make it uh, and then orientation orientation just keep it as a front uh, it is recommended to keep it front view and uh, we will talk about the customized view in the base view so this is very important when we talk about in base view, we will just uh, you know explain how it works so now let us go to layout so layout as you can see here this is a trimetric and this is top view and this is um, you know parent view which is a top view uh, front view sorry so if you want to have any other uh, you know uh, views you can just select it here so as soon as you select you can see the views are uh, coming up here and uh, the depending on your requirement you can just select it here so let me keep uh, all these things in these four views and you can see here the placement which is in automatic and as well as associative alignment so uh, if this is switched on what happens is when uh, you have uh, you know uh, this is our you know parent view so all the you know views will be aligned with parent view so if the parent view is moved from one place to another place so according to that all the views will move so uh, if you can see here uh, if this is switched off then you can move uh, each view independently okay so, so now we will cl click finish so as soon as you click finish all the views whatever we have selected here that they, they will be uh, generated since we are given you know automated uh, you know um, automatic alignment and then uh, you know uh, the associativity as you can see here if this is this view is moving according to that uh, even these views also will move so this is all about view creation wizards uh, guys uh, hope most of the uh, people will not use this uh, view creation wizard so we'll directly go into base views so in the next tutorial i will discuss on uh, base views guys uh, i hope you enjoyed this video please stay tuned and subscribe to my channel thank you